Hi guys, welcome po sa Hugot Sip na yan. This is Sir JV, your math kahugot and welcome po sa aking channel. So para po sa topic natin for today, we will be discussing about solving linear equation in two variables or system of linear equation in two variables using the graphical method. Tara guys, mga kahugot, mga kari life, let's have this topic. So our objective for today's video is to solve problem involving system of linear equation in two variables by letter A which is graphing method. So we will, we will be having other video for substitution and for elimination. So this is week 9 of our MELC for grade 8 students. So let's have our discussion guys. So, ang intersecting lines, guys, among the system of linear equation, ang intersecting lines lamang ang may one solution. So, sabi nila, when two lines intersect, the system is consistent, it has an answer, o may sagot po siya, at ang equation nila ay independent, since they are not really identical. So, ang system nila, guys, ay may one solution. So, if we're having an example of intersecting line, ito po example natin, Kung napansin niyo po, meron siyang point of intersection. Ang solution guys na yan, o yung point na yan, at natawag din solution. Ano nga ba yung solution na to? It's an ordered pair guys, na kung saan, both the line has been satisfied. So, among the system of linear equation, ang intersecting line lang, ang ginagamitan natin, na ang tatlong method natin sa pagkasagot. Ito yung graphical method, Elimination method and substitution method. So, farang sa ating video for today, we will be dealing with the graphical method. So, from the word graphical itself, guys, kailangan po natin siyang i-graph para mahanap ang point of intersection. Okay. So, in order to solve a system of linear equation, we need to find its point of intersection. At saka, guys, ang purpose natin para sa video ito ay paano mag ng mga line. If you have time guys, you may search on this channel kung paano mag ng linear equation using the x and y intercept. So, yun po ang gagamitin natin. For me guys, ito yung sa pinakamadaling paraan para mag ka ng isang line. So, have you still remembered kung paano ba makumuha ng x and y intercept? Tandaan nyo pa ba? Kung hindi tanda guys, Bibigyan ko ng simple recall. Kapag guys, kinukuha natin guys ang x-intercept ng ating line, ginagawa natin 0 ang y. Na kung saan ang ordered pair natin ay uh, a0, kung saan ang y natin ay 0. Kapag kinukuha naman natin ang y-intercept, ginagawa naman natin 0 ang x. So, ito ay may ordered pair na 0b. Let's have our example for this problem guys. So, meron tayong 2x plus 3y equals to 6 and 4x minus 3y equals to 12. So, dito ang sinold muna natin ay yung y-intercept kasi yung x natin ang ginawa natin 0. So, here we have 2 times 0 is definitely a 0. So, 3y plus 6. So, bring down lang natin yan para mawala guys yung 3 nyo hindi divide natin yung whole equation by 3. So, 3y divide by uh, 3 is y 3, uh, 6 divided by 3 is 2. Kaya po tayo may y equals to 2. So, ordered pair that is 0, 2. So, meron tayong first point o y-intercept para sa ating first equation. So, we have 4x minus 3y equals to 12 naman. So, same thing ang gagawin natin. We will apply 4 times 0 minus 3y equals to 12. Or just simply, negative 3y equals to 12. So, we're going to divide the whole equation by negative 3. Kaya yung 12 po natin ay magiging y equals to negative 4. In ordered pair, that is 0, negative 4. Kung medyo nahihirapan kayo makahabol sa aking ginawa, guys, simple lang po ang ginawa natin dito. Dito po ang ginawa natin, ang ating x ang ginawa natin 0 para makuha natin ang value ng y. It will give us our y-intercept. So, next natin naman ay ating x-intercept. So, same problem po tayo. Now, try to look guys. Ang na-replace ko naman ay yung y bilang 0 para makuha natin ang value ng x. 
So we have, for our problem, we have 2x plus 3 times 0 equals to 6. So definitely, mawawala na yung 3y natin. So become 2x equals to 6, dividing both sides by 2, it will become an x equals to 3. So ordered pair natin, yun ay 3, 0. So same thing will be done dun sa kabilang problem natin. So paltampulin natin ng 0, magkakamiran tayo ng 4x equals to 12, dividing both sides by 4, it will become a 3, or in ordered pair, that is the 3, 0. So ngayon guys, meron na tayong dalawang point, x intercept and y intercept for both equation. So pwede na po natin siyang i-grab. So we have 2, we have 0, 2, and 3, 0 for the first line, and 0, negative 4, and 3, 0 for our second line. So ngayon, magagrab po tayo. Ito po yung first line natin. So that is... 0, 2, and 3, 0. And we have our second line that is negative 0, negative 4, and 3, 0. So, ang point of intersection po nila ay 3, 0. Hence, guys, ang solution set po natin or ating sagot para sa ating equation ay 3, 0. Since dun po nag-intersect ang ating mga line. So, guys, ang pinaka-essential skill nyo dito Para malaman niyo po ang graphical method, ay dapat maalam kayo mag-graph ng mga lines natin. So, if you have time guys, you may find some video here in my channel na makapag-explain sa inyo kung paano mag-graph ng mga tinatawag nating lines. Okay po ba yun? So, let's have another example. So, we're going to graph the following equation by x and y intercept. So, we have an x plus y equals to 5 and a 2x minus y equals to 4. So, first, we make the x0 to find our y-intercept. So, napadali, meron tayong y equals to 5 or 0, 5. So, same thing will be done on the other problem. So, 2x minus y equals to 4. So, if x will become a 0, may isang 0. So, meron tayong negative y equals to 4. Dividing both sides by negative 1, it will become a negative 4 or sorted pair, we have 0, negative 4. So, meron na tayong first point. So, ngayon, we're going to look for our second point. So, meron tayong y-intercept, si x-intercept naman. So, y naman na magiging natin 0. So, sa ating first problem, napakadali, we have an x equals to 5 or 5, 0. Since ang x naman, 0 matik, 5 agad ang ating x. So, 5, 0 and 0, 5 para sa ating first equation. Sa ating next equation naman, we have 2x minus 0 equals to 4. 2x equals to 4. Dividing both sides by 2, it will become an x equals to 2. So, or per natin, we have 2, 0. So, we have 2, 0 and 0, negative 4 para sa ating second line. Matik. Ibig sabihin, pwede na tayong mag -rap. Kung igagrap natin guys yan, so sa first line natin, ulitin ko ha, Meron tayong 5, 0, and 0, 5. Sa ating namang second line, we have 2, 0, and 0, negative 4. Anong gagawin natin? Using the two points for the said line, pwede na natin siyang i-grab. i natin ngayon, guys, ha? So ngayon, first line tayo, syempre, we have a 5, 0, and 0, 5. Kitang-kitang pa naman. So, and the other thing, we have a 0, negative 4, and 2, 0. So, basically guys, merong point kung saan nag-intersect ang dalawang line na yun. At yung point na yun, ang tinatawag nating solution. So, that is, from reading, using our Cartesian plane, that is 3, 2. And that's our solution. So, guys, napakasimple lang po ng ginawa natin. Ano ba yung mga essential skill o prerequisite skill na kailangan natin? Una, kailangan maalam ko siyempre yung mag ng mga lines. Alam mo kung ano yung tinatawag ng x-intercept at y-intercept at kung kailan mo gagawin 0 ang x at 0 ang y. So, napaka-importante po nun. Okay? Para malaman natin kung naiintindihan natin ninyo o natin ang discussion natin, syempre, magbibigay ulit si Sir Hugot o si Sir JV ng 5 minute na problem. 
So I'm going to give you this set of problem. Guys, you have 5 minutes to answer the following item. Good luck po! So, bibigay ko lang sa inyo guys, after nito, ay yung sagot mismo, which is our ordered pair. So, 5 minutes guys, you may have it.
five minutes up guys so let us see whether your answer is correct or not oh yan po nilabas na agad ang sagot so we have a negative three one for our number one and we have five zero for number two tama po ba kayo i hope you got it correct guys so alam ko na mo worth it ang pagka-practice ninyo sa bahay ninyo so i hope you learn something from this video and i hope you you got it correct if you have some question queries a uh, suggestion recommendation comments about this video you may comment it below guys below this video or you may find me at facebook hugot sip na yan okay i hope you also follow my page guys so that is my page so, guys ingat po god bless and see you on my next video mga kamat hugot ingat po and god bless